I love the thought of Sue playing defense for Seattle. I think if there was any way to make that unit stronger, you bring in that big guy and watch as your entire unit becomes better. Not only is he a premier defensive tackle, but he's got a mystique about him. Love it or hate it, Sue intimidates people. He's a tough guy. And that's one thing that Seattle is great at. Why not bring another guy in? And the big glaring hole in this story, though, is the cap. I don't see how the Seahawks are going to afford to pay him when they have to pay Russell Wilson, whatever it is that he's going to get. Yeah. And what, what do you think, Chris? I, I mean, I think, sure, Sue wants to play for the Seahawks. Who doesn't want to play for the Seahawks? I, th true. I think a lot of people want to play for the Seahawks. And he didn't even come out and say it in, like, an open quote. It was supposed sources from a Bleacher okay. Report guy. Okay. You know, I think that guy was a more notable writer for Bleacher Report. but. Mm -hmm. I don't know how trusted that could be. That's it's all speculation. It's all speculation, yep. and who doesn't want to go to the Seahawks, especially if you're a defender? Mm -hmm. I, I don't think he's going to the Seahawks. I don't think they can do it. No. Uh, they just don't okay. have enough money, yeah. especially if they re-sign Lynch. Um, but then here you go with Detroit. From their side, they're still saying, you know, we are confident that we're going to get him back. Yes. And, and what does that mean? Because Unless they franchise tag him, I don't see him coming back. You know, no. and that's a $26 million hit for a franchise? 26.7, uh, I think. Roughly. roughly He's already going to cost us over $9 million this year, no matter what. We're because, just counting. Yeah. So, you know, he's going to cost us something, no matter what. We need him, in a sense. But with all that extra money, who knows what we could do. What we, we could lose? We could address a lot. Yeah. Uh, it, it's hard to say. But, uh, and then there's another team, the Oakland Raiders. The Raiders. Yeah. They actually have to spend a certain amount before a certain day. I'm not really sure so they what have, the details are. They have are money on available, but they have they got money so much money. They have $49 million right now available on their cap to okay. just take on players. And that's without cutting all these additional guys that they're going to cut because they have a lot of uh, pretty terrible contracts mm -hmm. on their roster. They're going to try to get out a few of those. Okay. And uh, they're going to look at the top player in free agency, and who, who is that? That's Indominus Sue. Mm -hmm. And they've already come out and said that they want him. Uh, they're going to try to get him in free agency, and Sue knows that that's the team that's going to be willing to pay him the most simply because they can. Yep. So, sure, Sue might want to play for Seattle, but is he willing to take half the pay? No, he's not going to do that. No. I, I mean, time will tell, but I think he'll be in a Raiders uniform. I just can't see the Lions actually going through with the franchise tag.